It is time for the Ferradelli bonus. All right, we're talking about historic snow. It is snow in Biloxi, Mississippi, right on the Gulf, right on the beach right there. Some places have seen up to a foot of snow in Louisiana, so I want to show you what's happening and let's talk about why it is happening. First of all, look at all that heavy snow. Snowfall rates around two inches an hour in New Orleans is about to end there, but the heavy snow is moving through Pensacola and it's going to turn completely to snow in Tallahassee in about the next, I'd say, two hours or so, and a lot of places picking up eight plus inches of snow, believe it or not. Look at these temperatures, 20s, 27 New Orleans, 24 Pensacola. Temperature dropped from 48 to 39 now in Tallahassee over the past couple of hours. So the colder air is working its way in from the polar vortex. A part of this has broken off and pushed into the United States. Cold air is very dense and here's what's happening. We have a stalled out front and we have a storm system developing in the Gulf and what it's doing is it's pushing the warm air up and over the very dense cold air at the ground. That's called overrunning. And if you're going to get a big snowstorm along the Gulf Coast, it's going to happen because of overrunning. So all this heavy snow makes its way east into northern Florida overnight tonight with a mix of snow and sleet there, but nothing for us, unfortunately, if you like the snow. But in New Orleans, the old record back in 1895, and that's not even official, is 8.2 inches of snow. We're looking at probably close to 10 inches in total there. And in Tallahassee, three or four inches of snow is possible. The old record, 2.8 inches of snow. So it truly is historic. I'm going to end with this. The USA is by far the coldest below normal any Anywhere on Earth right now because of all that warm air in the Arctic displacing the cold air to the south. But on average, the Earth is actually record warm today. That is your Baradelli bonus.